loves welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is stephanie i film a chit chat get ready with me for you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed this video i basically just discussed some topics and did my makeup while i think so i'm not going to waste any of your time i'm going to get right into it i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to subscribe if you're not and give this video a thumbs up thank you so i'm filming a chit chat get ready with me today i was just in the mood so i thought to do so and i was like why not try something different so today we're going to be talking about some topics which i know you guys have already seen in the title and i'm going to be doing my makeup yes i have not done a proper get ready with me with you guys on this channel so that's what we're going to be doing today and i think it's going to be fun so you guys let me know if you enjoyed this this is actually going to be my first time doing this but you guys are just watching me do what i do and um we'll be talking so you guys listen to me if you have any questions about my makeup products you let me know and i'll get back to you in the comments before the new year started i feel like i was trying to convince myself that 2023 by the way if you see me looking over here my mirror is there you guys know i cannot do this without the mirror so just pardon me so yeah, as I was saying, I said, I feel like I was trying to convince myself that 2023 was going to be, you know, a different year. You guys know how you start the new year, different, you want different identity. Although I wasn't, I wasn't all about, you know, new year, new me in 2023, but I just felt like I would have like a different energy. I felt like my growth, my identity. And yeah, right now we are in May and I'm just like, I actually do feel like, there was a lot of change i would say i feel so different than last year a lot of things have actually changed in many aspects of my life a lot has changed my way of looking at things relationship my mindset and on some days i feel like yeah we actually do have the struggle of like you know it's kind of normal for <laughs> every human i would say i was in a rut a few weeks ago mentally right now i feel so much better than how it was and i would say i am in a very very good space and i am fine but when it comes to content creation i honestly cannot say the same guys because i feel like i have been struggling so much i was trying to create a thumbnail last night and i just couldn't do it <laughs> which is very strange because thumbnails are like very easy to do but at the same time they are not very easy to do because you need to have an idea of what you are trying to create then make it you know come into reality i had no idea how to go about it like creating content lately hasn't been the easiest and yeah you guys do i show up but i have had to struggle and be able to do this through discipline if there's one thing i know that has helped me greatly this period is an actual change in mindset having some mindset change is essentially going to dictate your life like the way you think the way you handle things that does have an effect on how you live how you show up for things how life is going to show up for you i am so glad i have actually made this mindset shift i don't want to look crazy it's not like i'm fully there yet i have been working on myself really really hard and i have just noticed a huge difference in my life like in the past few weeks the way i look at things the way i approach situations my whole thought process like i had a few things i wanted for myself this year and these are things that i've actually been working on you know to make sure that the year ends well for me and that i get closer to my goals because at the end of the day you actually do have to do that for yourself no one is going to save you no one is going to do it for you so that realization and also like stepping out of that victim mindset is so important i am just really trying to find myself at the moment because for many years i thought i knew exactly what i wanted to do where i wanted to go who i wanted to be even who i wanted to be with i thought i did know the type like i thought i didn't know all of that and as i am getting older i am beginning to realize that i feel like i do not even know at all i feel like i know somewhat but i don't know everything fully it's just like i am trying to navigate life and find my purpose what am i living for what is my purpose on earth what why am i even put here on this earth do i want to do what truly makes me happy or do i just want to sit around 
and look at what everyone else is doing and wanting their lives because it's so easy to go on social media and compare yourself to your mates even your juniors those who you are way older than those who are way older than you are friends strangers but one beautiful thing about life is we actually are not supposed to do that like your life isn't comparable to theirs because you are you i am me we are all different in our own way everyone have had such different parts in life like different nationality different ethnicity different background different family different environment different influences and if there is one thing that got me in a very very terrible mental state recently it was this i realized that the first quarter of the year had ended and i was nowhere close to all of the goals that i had set to achieve for myself and now you're just anxious because it's like now you've done nothing and the year is going by fast like it's already may right now and the year is not waiting for anybody time is not waiting for anybody and you begin to doubt yourself because that is exactly what i started doing i started doubting my abilities i started doubting the whole process i started to question myself a lot of course i am beginning to doubt my abilities and of comparison sets in if there is one thing i have learned recently it is instead of comparing yourself to others you have to get inspired instead of looking at it like oh i want to be like this or that you should actually look at it like i can achieve that as well and i can create my own version of that because it's a great thing to get inspired by others you know it's great to look at people and see what they are doing but you also have to realize that you can never be like them you are you you are unique you are different and you can never have exact same life that they have you just have to take what inspires you about them and put it into your life and do it your own way because you are you and you are different and you are always going to have your own ways of doing things Things. you're always going to have your own style of doing things that's just a little piece of advice for someone out there so you don't fall into the whole i recently have to call myself out of that being said exciting news <laughs> guys tomorrow i'm going on a date i do not mean a solo date like i mean an actual date like a date date where you go on a date with a guy <laughs> I know I do not really talk about my relationship, love life on here so much because I just feel like sometimes when you put out that stuff, you really do not have so much control over it. So yeah, I want to be able to control the things I can control and let you guys into the things I want you to gradually. Does that make any sense? I'm not even going to say that anything exciting has really, really happened or has been happening to me when it comes to that aspect so like there's little or nothing to show but anyways tomorrow we are going to go on this date and quite excited like i don't want to get my hopes up so much because you know you know how this other gender can be <laughs> i don't want to have very very high hopes so that whatever happens happens but of course i'm taking you guys with me so yeah more details about that will actually be in the next vlog so you guys just stay tuned for that and make sure to subscribe if you have not <laughs> yeah subscribe to the channel if you are new here i feel like it's going to be an exciting time tomorrow because the way this guy has been talking <laughs> i really want like you know how somebody just you know how men can be and they're running their mouth and they're like Ehh. so yeah um he asked me to give him time tomorrow to you know we should just spend some time together so that is what we're going to be doing we're going to be going out i really do not know the itinerary for tomorrow he said it's all on him which is kind of nice to hear um but maybe today i'm going to ask so that <laughs> i know what is happening and i know you know how to dress up for it so yeah subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for that vlog it is definitely going to be coming out and i'm going to like give you guys all of the tea because you know yeah i feel like i want to share this one i know i look a little bit crazy right now but trust the process 
you guys just trust the process okay everything will come together another thing that i think i would like to talk about is friendship and when it comes to that i'm not going to lie i feel like i have been blessed in that aspect this is going to be difficult talking and lining my lips i'm making the line crooked so i'm just going to do this quickly so i cannot complain about friendship because in that aspect i feel like i have been blessed so well with amazing friends amazing people in my life and i've never really had like a very very bad experience when it comes to friendship even though yeah i have had arguments with my friends we've had our issues but we find a way to resolve all of that without it being toxic without it being like a bad thing like a big thing so yeah but i have just found out that managing and maintaining friendship in your 20s is like wow <laughs> yeah you you have to be very very intentional like there are times where i feel like i could be better i could be a better friend like i could show up even better than i do i could actually show up more and i know not everyone of course not everyone wants you to call them every day to check in or check up on them like even myself you don't have to call in or check in every day in order to keep in touch and this is kind of easy to navigate when both parties know that even though they are not calling you every time even though they are not checking in every single minute of the day you know that there is love and this person would go above and beyond at any time of the day for you i just feel like in our 20s yeah we actually do sometimes neglect this aspect of our life we neglect family i'm just trying to say yeah you have to make time for family and friends and i say this because i stumbled on an interview i don't know if it was really true on social media yesterday night and they were asking bill gates i think i don't i'm not very don't quote me on this question but i think the question was like um what did you learn or what's your 20s something about 20s or 30s or so and his response was he wished he had known there was more to life than just work yeah that was what he said and that really hit me hard because i have just noticed that like in our 20s guys we are on the grind we are working non-stop everyone is trying to figure out life everyone is trying to figure out what's our next move what do we do so there is this constant hustle there's this constant movement there's this constant busyness there's this constant you know thought of having to work 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 that staying close to our family checking up on our friends you know keeping in touch with people that are close to you it's just becoming harder but it is so important to stay close to family it's so important to have it always at the back of your mind that it is not a good idea to isolate yourself even while you are trying to find a meaning or, or make meaning out of life you should try to in your own way show up as much as possible for those who love you yeah we should show up for our friends we should show up for our family despite all of life's craziness because at the end of the day <laughs> not everyone knows what they're doing like we're not even sure we know what we are doing i feel like everyone is still trying to figure out their shit i don't know about you but sometimes i feel like i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> i'm so being like i'm being open and very very honest here i i don't know sometimes i feel like i do like what do i what am i even <laughs> what am i even doing what am i striving for what am i it's 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 so confusing guys and it can be so crazy like sometimes i wish there was a handbook or a manual on how to do this adulthood thing but there's not and you find out that everybody's journey is just different and everyone has to go through their own journey and one thing i have had to remind myself constantly especially during this period is that i have time i know sometimes we get carried away and we feel like you know time is going and you've not achieved this you're getting older the days are counting it's going to be 2024 soon before you know it's going to be 2030 but guys you have to constantly remind yourself that you have time and it is you against you and nobody else like it is you against you you are the one like if you are going to be setting any compare it is you against your pre previous it is you against your previous self it is you with your future self it is me against me and i really do not like i really should stop stressing i have to learn to give myself grace i've had to learn 
I am learning. I am constantly on that journey to remind myself always that, girl, you need to give yourself grace because you are doing well for yourself. Trust me. And I feel like you should also have that at the back of your mind because there is no age to figuring out life. So this is not just to only me, but to you out there watching this video, listening to my voice right now, like you are going to get through this and you will navigate life on your own terms and everything that is supposed to come to you will come to you and it will come for you at the right time at the appointed time i feel like a lot of us miss it because we are so impatient i am also impatient i'm not going to act like i am not or i'm not guilty of a lot of the things like see i feel like i'm making this video for me and also for somebody else yeah i'm talking to me right now i'm not even going to act like i'm not because i need to remind myself of all of these things i have just said i am not the only one who feels all of this confusion and questions and yeah just one thing that has been helping me lately is just listening to god like the word of god reading my bible and doing my part because at the end of the day you still have a part to play in all of these things um they say we create our own future so you will not just sit back and say that everything should come to you oh i just realized i did not use powder but that doesn't even matter there is no need <laughs> i already put setting spray so yeah guys that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i tried to style my hair earlier today i do not know what is happening and even though it's not the best it's still nice came out nice i feel like my makeup came out nice too this is actually what i do for my makeup and if you guys have questions about it just leave it down in the comment section i will get back to you so guys i hope you enjoyed this video i know this was very very different i want to try new things on this channel you guys let me know what you think about this type of videos you guys let me know if you enjoyed the whole get ready with me while talking to you you guys please let me know in the comment section because if i don't hear from you how will i know for me i just want to make more topics like this and you know just do my makeup with you guys and talk to you about stuff that goes through my mind sometimes so yeah that's the whole point of this video that's the purpose of this video and i hope you learned one or two things from this video you can also tell me topics you want me to talk about tell me what you want to you know hear my thoughts on any random topic you know just let me know so make sure to tune in for the weekly vlogs which will go up on sunday make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell if you haven't a new vlog is going to be coming out on sunday so yeah i'm going to end this now and i'm going to see you guys in my next video thank you